Right, Stuart. There it is. The Bing, not the Bing. Fritz um, Newmeyer. No, I've never heard of it either. Uh, from 1906. All the repairs done now. Uh, steam's probably just about up. And there it is today, powering this uh, very nice Bing twin steam hammer. No effort at all for this little thing. So, let's have a use my spare um, beam safety valve there. The uh, bracket and all this on top here, that was all bent, had to be straightened up. Right, the resolder, the boiler back to the firebox. Bit of a tricky job that. Um, the flywheel kept flying off. As you know, it's only like a, a Mazak or lead even, some sort of lead alloy. Um, so I made a shim up, put around the shaft and tapped it back on. Staying on at the moment. This works. So I'm so pleased to get this going, it's given me quite a bit of trouble actually. But I've bought it now. Okay, what we do is hurt the hammers, because you probably think it rattles like hell, aren't you? That's why I put steam hammers on it. That will stop that. Take it off. Ah see. Look at that. Very, very nice. Not a rattle in sight. 1906. Fantastic. I'm thinking the base is original, but very few photographs or pictures available do show a wooden base like that. They also show that there's probably a beam safety belt as well. That's why I put one in of one of my spares in it. This was actually supplied with a water level plug stuck in there, no safety at all. So, um, not very clever. Um, put one of my old burners in there, that's a Bing single burner in there. It was supplied with a double, not the original. It more or less melted the engine, so it had to be changed. Even now, this one, if you have that width too high, it runs a little bit too fast. But, uh, as you can see, look at that. Very, very smooth. I said earlier, I've never heard of a Fritz Neumeyer. Not very much on the internet about them. But the very few bits I did find, it seems like it was a quite a big factory producing some very, very nice engines. If they were still around today, they'd be well out of my price range, that's for sure. But, um, I'm happy with this. Actually, back in working condition. Shin me back on it. Yes, it is stressed a little bit. I haven't really polished up too much because the boiler's got some abrasive marks on it. So I thought I would leave them on there and I'm actually going to tarnish this a little to just make it match the, the boiler. You believe that, you believe anything. <laughs> To make a special clamp thing or bracket thing to solder on top of that boiler. A piece of brass bent in a various ways to hold that on. Try and error really. But it works. Put 
a little bit more uh, of the old steam hammers, I think, before we stop. Yeah. Five minutes. There we go. The asterisk for us. Every single one of our videos. It doesn't matter where I am. I could be on the moon. If you think. Hey. Hey. Oh. Spring broke. Spring broke. Come on down. Just uh, we put that together. There we go. No, I've had enough of that spring. Too old. Anyway, you've seen the steam hammers run. So uh, we're coming up to what, six and a half minutes, probably long enough, we just take the burner out of there, blow it out and um, let it run down. How about that? Fantastic. Fritz Neumeier, 1906. Running a pair of uh, Bing, probably of a similar age, Sting Hammers. Thank you.